Good morning investors and traders. In today's segment we'll be covering stock market and its future direction. If you haven't subscribed to our channel I highly recommend you to do so. Before we begin the risk disclosures and risk warnings are in front of you. If you have any questions please feel free to come back to us. Now let me bring out the MT4 platform and we begin the conversation by looking at the nasdaq chart which is also known as the us tech 100 what we see from the nasdaq is that the nasdaq index yesterday did a very intriguing price action meaning this particular explosive moves that we see in for the the, the the day before that and yesterday the price went into the area of its all time high but then quickly retraced from that particular level of all-time high closing much away from the highs of the day now obviously that is a concern for investors and traders why that has happened and what does that really mean now given the fact that the price is trading above the 50 day simple moving average 100 day simple moving average and of course the 200 the likely chances are that we may see the prices continuing their journey from here onwards to the upside however if this momentum fails from this particular price point then what we are likely to see under those circumstances is price forming a double top first stop over here the other top over here and consequently what could happen from there onwards is prices pricing moving to the downside or this particular index moving to the downside losing all of its charm losing all the upward momentum now of course the question really then is where is the next support zone if the price does come, kind of come into next area of support right because where can we potentially see the prices coming back to where we could potentially re-enter this particular trade and that particular area is right between this particular this area of consolidation so if the price now uh, fails to break to the upside and if it returns then of course this could be another area of support which is just over here and then if the price comes into this area of support and then kind of starts to bounce back up from here that would be very positive otherwise what we are likely to see really is a prices coming into this area of support and then bouncing back up so once again if the price comes into this area of support the area which is slightly higher than the previous area of support and then we see the prices kind of continuing to change its direction started to move higher then the chances are it is going to take out this particular area of super resistance and move further up the reason that the chances of that happening are higher because if we see the us 500 meaning the dow, uh, sorry dow jones 30 uh, the us 30 index we already see the prices moving above their all-time high going into a new territory the same is also true for the us 500 index as well where the prices have already gone beyond the previous all-time high and that again that particular area used to be right around it here the price showed no hesitation when it came into this area initially there was some hesitation but then there was a huge momentum to the upside and i believe the same could happen with the nasdaq now as well let's continue to monitor the price action and we'll be back with more price action very soon